solving equations with radicals, and extraneous solutions. In order to solve this radical equation, we will first square both sides. On the left side, when we square x plus 1, it means to write it twice and multiply. On the right, we have a square root being squared. Therefore, what's underneath the square root can come out. We now need to gather like terms and set the equation equal to 0. We need to subtract 3x and 7 from both sides. We end up with the quadratic x squared minus 1x minus 6 equals 0. This quadratic will factor. It factors into x minus 3, x plus 2 equals 0. This equation has solutions then of positive 3 and negative 2. We now need to check the answers to make sure they work. When we substitute 3 back into the original equation, the left side becomes 4 and the right side becomes the square root of 16. Therefore, the number 3 works. However, when we substitute negative 2 in for x, it doesn't work. Negative 1 does not equal the square root of 1. Therefore, negative 2 is called an extraneous solution, which means it doesn't work. So our only solution is 3.